Hi, everybody. Welcome. Hello. Look who's in my lap. I feel like a Bond villain. <laughs> it's yeah. my kitty best friend. Kitty best friend. I'm okay. This. See you all later on. Good night, everybody. <laughs> Welcome to happy hour. How is yeah. everybody? Cheers, yeah. by the way. Let me raise Cheers a glass. To, uh, everything. What's uh, what you got there, Heather? What you drinking? It's actually iced coffee. <laughs> iced coffee. Okay. That's more healthy than this. I can tell you that much. I'm just having a glass of wine. What are you having, Baba Martini? Yeah. I'm having right a before martini. you signed in, Heather and I were talking about our boobs because we're both just... Well, like, everyone is. They're just constantly in the freaking way today. And Heather's like, oh my God, I can't take it anymore. So excuse me while I adjust. Cheers, everyone. <laughs> hey, Presque Isle, Maine. Hi, Melissa. Hi, Jennifer and Kelly and Sandra and Michael, whose nickname is Speedy and Eric. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Uh, Patricia Muller is with us. She says, aloha all. I, I am going to guess that she's in uh, Hawaii. Hawaii. Right? Yeah, yeah maybe. that's great. Maybe. Oh, from Savannah. Savannah, I can almost see you tonight. That's fantastic. Wonderful. What a, if you haven't been to Savannah ever in your life, you need to go to Savannah. It's a beautiful city. They have so many things to do. I love Savannah. I just went right before we signed in. I brought um, Karamia this uh, late this morning after the show got all four wisdom teeth out. Yeah. So. Um, she will not let me post the video I took in the car. I sent it to Bob, but she, she was like, you can send it to chit chat, but don't post it. So she's been very giggly all day, but, um, the, the Novocaine or whatever is starting to wear off. So I just gave her some painkillers and some scrambled eggs and a banana. She very can't good. eat all soft food for two weeks. Wow. Gidget Suarez is saying hello from California. Uh, Hi, Gidget. City. Hi, Gidget. You know, I don't know that I ever really met a real Gidget. In real life? In real life. Just uh, I've seen that old movie, you know, from way back when with Sandra Day. But is I've never Gidget, met a real Gidget. Is Gidget short for something? Girl Midget. But I mean, like, I wonder if for Gidget. For Honest to God. I, when, when I say that in that movie, I saw that movie on Turner Classics. And, you know, Sandra D was very small and Gidget, I guess that was made back in, I don't know, 1959 or something like that. It stood for girl midget. Ooh. I don't think they would do that today. You couldn't do that today. You wouldn't think you would do, do that, that today. today. No, no. Um, uh, we got a hello from Gastonia, Tabitha Chapman Spencer. Hey, hey, Tabitha. Mm -hmm. um, Florida Keys, Donna Daniels. I was just talking, oh my God, I was just talking to my husband about that. He is, he used to go to the Florida Keys once a year and then, you know, he met me and I ruined his life and then the pandemic came. So he's yeah. been double dipping on ruination. He misses it so, so, so much. I love the Keys. I love every part of the Keys. I think it's just such a unique place. And again, if you've never been to the Keys, don't, don't fly in, fly into Miami and then drive. Yeah. Over the, uh, yeah. over the eight mile bridge. Yeah, seven miles, eight miles. Seven mile bridge. Yeah. The drive from Miami to the Keys is amazing because yeah. there's like one road. And if so if there's traffic on it, you're sitting in it. But you go through all the towns. You go through Largo and Marathon. Isla, Isla Morada. Isla Morada. You'll go past the campground. Um, uh, yeah. Big Pine Key where the miniature key deer live. That's the campground we always stay at is on Big Pine Key. And the little key deer, they're not much bigger than, I mean, Finn is bigger than some of them. Yeah, yeah. And they have no fear of people. So like when the kids were younger and we would take them camping over a Christmas break or spring break or whatever, we'd be sitting at our little picnic table outside our tent eating breakfast or whatever. And the deer would come and try to steal food off your plate. I mean, they're just so incredibly right. tame. They're magical. Yeah. And so if you, if Bob is right, if you ever have a chance to go to the Keys, um, I mean, you're driving on, on the eight mile bridge or the seven mile bridge. I can never remember what it is. Um, I even know the Key West song from Canada to Florida. Key West welcomes you from the Empire State to the Golden <laughs> Gate. Key West welcomes you. You are a treasure trove of these songs. You know all the songs with people's names and you know all the like weird place name songs. Here we, go. Here we go with another one. You just mentioned Gidget. 
Yeah. She acts like a, she acts like a teenager. She acts like a, she acts like a baby, but I say maybe. Nah, I can't remember that one. I heard it on, on the song. Just, just based on the opening lyrics, I'm already uncomfortable. <laughs> oh, it gets worse. <laughs> and, and then it, it's descri it describes her, and then um, it says, the rest of the shipment, standard equipment, gidge the <laughs> one for me. Ah, let me tear my ears off my head. Ew. <laughs> I want you to imagine a sitcom on the Disney Channel where the female lead is described as being being small, looking like a baby, but having the standard equipment. People I know it. go to prison for that. If she says she loves you, you can bet your boots she loves you. If she says she hates you, that can also mean she loves you. Ooh. Oh, good. Oh, good. So Bad. let's. Let's be confusing about consent while we're at it. <laughs> bad message. Very bad message. Oh my God. It very well may be she's just a baby in a girl's disguise. I forgot, I can't remember the rest of it. You're making this up. No, no, no. No, this no, no. Is not a real thing. <laughs> As a matter of I think that song, I, I could be wrong. I think it was a hit record too. And not a big one, but I think it was a hit record. I'm gonna pull this up right now. Let me see if I can find okay. it on YouTube. Gidget theme song. When was that on TV? Was that a movie or a TV show? Um, I think it, it was there were movies. There were several <laughs> movies. There was Gidget uh with uh, Sandra D and James Darren, who is a real handsome guy. Um okay. And then there was uh, like a couple of other ones they made because it was so popular. She was like a surfer girl or something. Because um, I know The Flying Nun was a TV show, right? That's Sally Field. Sally Field was yeah. Gidget. Okay. Here's was, no, 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 no. She was the second Gidget. Sandra D was was the original. The first Gidget. Okay. Here's the Gidget theme song. I did find it. Let's listen. <laughs> I don't think that. I don't think that's it. Not the song. That's not the song. That's that's got to be like the second movie or something. It's James Darren Gidget, nineteen. Right, let me, okay, let me see now. Nineteen fifty nine or something like that. James Darren. Yeah. Gidget. Here we go. So you have to give me all these details because I don't know. All right. Oh, I mean, I, I saw it on Turner Classic. I don't know that much about it either. Oh, when I had my really bad um, pandemic insomnia, I watched one of those uh, beach blankety movies, like Frankie oh, and or so whatever. Bad. Okay, yeah. first of all, if you <laughs> think that the teenagers in the movie Grease were middle aged, oh yeah, you need to get you some Frankie and Annette. Frankie, Frankie and Annette were the yeah. younger. There were there were people in those those movies. I saw one of those uh, a few months ago too. Okay, they were forty. Here we go. I mean, now, granted, um, the guys, because I just watched a couple of uh, minutes of Greece a few nights ago, because it's like the anniversary of the birthday or whatever. The guy that played Sonny in Greece, that guy was 50, I think, when they shot that. The black hair. The curly kind of black yeah, hair. Yeah, 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 yeah. He had to be 50. Yeah. You're a stranger. All right, hang on, hang on, hang on. I got to skip the ad. This That's is it. That's it. She acts sort of teenage, just in between age, looks about four foot three. Although she's just small fry, just about so high, Gidget is the one for me. A regular tomboy, but dressed for a prom. Boy, how cute can one girl be? A 
Although she's not king size, her finger is ring size. Gidget is the one for me. Here we go. If she says she loves you, you can bet your boots she loves you. If she says she hates you, that can also mean she loves you. It very well may be she's just a baby speaking romantically. If that's a bad feature, I'll be the teacher. The gadget is the one for me. I told you. Doug, uh, Doug Rain said, the quality entertainment like this, how can you not have won the Marconi Award? It's a good question, Doug. Thanks, everybody. Okay, I think the more questionable lyrics are coming up now. This is the musical interview. Where the hell's my microphone on now? She's not much on glamour, and she should improve her grammar. Still I sigh and stammer, and my heart beats like a little old hammer. Strictly from Dixie, face like a pixie, shorter than girls should be. The rest of the shipment. Standard equipment, just a doll in dungaree. The gadget is the one for me. Oh my God. You can't tell me, you cannot tell me, ladies, that we have not made progress in this country. You know what? Except for like women, that. I'm creeped out. Except, except for what? I didn't hear you, Heather. Oh, I said as an exceptionally short woman, I'm creeped out. <laughs> yeah, I bet. I bet. And I'm not going to do any gidget jokes here, okay? <laughs> so anyway. The rest of this shipment is standard, standard equipment. equipment. La, da, 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 da. What if a, a man said to me, shorter than girls should be, I think I would knock him out. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, there was there was so much in there that was troubling. Like I'm picturing, I'm looking at the the picture that goes with the uh, song. Put, bring it up to my camera so you can see it. No, absolutely not. He's he's getting the one two punch the second line. <laughs> James James there. I mean, he was an actor. He took the gig. You know, everybody wanted to. You know. If this showed up at my door, because Karen Mia is also short, Heather. If the